What's going on, everybody? It's Mike with Tadao Sports. Today was going to be just a regular old mail day type, type video where I show you some of the things I've been picking up on eBay and also some of the cards I'm going to be sending out for grading and the reholdering. Instead, it turned out that we have a surprise box that came in the mail that I've been waiting for for, I don't know, two weeks, I think. It was supposed to be mailed on the 5th of April, and it finally showed up. And I'm talking about my box of Bowman First Edition. Boom. It's about time this thing showed up, because I've been looking to rip this thing for quite some time now. So I am going to do that right now. I haven't seen uh, too many of these opened. I know that uh, people were doing them early, but... I didn't really want to spoil it for myself until I actually got my box. So I really only watched one get opened. I think that was on the uh, Striker Breaks channel. But uh, other than that, what are we looking for here? Sky Blues, one out of two. Rainbow Foil, one out of 2520. And Chrome Autograph, one in 260. All right, there's your odds. i have to get myself a nice thumbnail of this here. For the video but other than that i don't want to waste too much time i just want to get into it bowman first sweet all right hopefully that means we get lots of first firsts boom straight into it straight out the box straight to getting ripped good news is is that by the time i hit the post office box and got back to the house. Baseball card store is open, so I was able to swing by and get some more top loaders. Well, let's do this. First pack, top right. What do we got? All right, Ooh, these are nice. All right. Got Trey Sweeney, first, first. Diego Rincon, Ronnie Cantero, Henry Mendez. I really have not looked who are the top prospects. I'm thinking I'm going to know some of the names when it's time. Oh, there's Luciano, cool. Obviously not his first, but I'm a Giants fan, so I'll keep that one aside. Marte, Beatty, and Salas. I know a lot of guys were talking about what, De La Cruz is the one name that uh, people like. I think Tatis is little brothers in this. We shall see as we go along. And if I don't know, well, it'll be fun to find out as we go. It'll be fun to do afterwards. Ortega. All right, Khalil Watson. First, first sky blue. Very nice. Pack out here to set those on. And of course, just as every other video that I do, I forgot to cut my sleeves. And I'm definitely going to do it for these foils because I don't want to mess them up. And I know my style of sleeving. I will mess them up if I don't cut it. I don't know what it is about certain sleeves. So like the ultra pro penny sleeves that come in the individual hunter packs they seem like they are easier to use than the ultra pro, pro sleeves that come in the 500 uh quantity mega packs you know with the individual sleeves uh the individual 125 packs because you know you buy 10,000 uh penny sleeves that's how you get them but i don't know for some reason those seem easier there's a torkelson very nice Laura, first, first. Lorenzo. Man, there's going to be a lot of a lot of first, first in here. Sweet. Vera. Another Luciano. Blaze Jordan. Leover Piguero. And there you go. Well, overall, I'm thinking that the, uh, I like the design. That's for sure. I do like the design of tops this year all around so far. Tops and Bowman, so 
hopefully it produces, I mean, heck, it's even gonna, so I like the design and I definitely like the class that's coming out. Series two should be real fun and tops. Miziel Urbina, we got actually two of his redemptions back. Oops, wrong pile. And we got uh, Pedro Pineda for Sky Blue. Yeah, so if uh, you remember back a while back, a long time ago, heck, was that Bowman Chrome last year? He had the, uh, I want to say it was the regular Bowman Chrome Hobby Box, not the HTA. But we had back-to-back uh, -back redemptions in that. They were like, I don't know if they were stuck together, if we got lucky with a hot box or what. But we ended up with two of the uh, um, Miseal Urbina autos and those just came in so that was kind of cool to see hopefully i'll have those in the mail day here coming up velasquez Venezuela, Mauricio, nolasco colson montgomery jay allen eddie's leonard all right Wow, okay, so pile over here is about, well, it looks like it's about 55-45, first first. First Bowman's versus uh, not first Bowman's. So that's good, you got quite a bit of them in there. There's Julio, he's up in the show now. Another Torkelson. Sugaste, Giants, all right, Austin Martin, Ian Lewis, Jeter Downs. Montero, Jordan Walker, Labrada, and Robert Dominguez. All right. Any names so far that I've missed that are uh, highly, you know, highly anticipated prospects? Let me know in the comments. I'm gonna have to go back and look myself. Martin Jimenez. Preciado, Lizarraga first, Alejandro Pia. Hey, there's Ellie De La Cruz. I know that's a good name. Ellie De La Cruz. All right. Where was he drafted? He was drafted free agent. All right. Signed as a free agent. How old is he? I'm curious. So he is born 1102. So he just turned 20 a couple months ago. All right, Cespedes, Hero, Trash, Lopez, Helio Ramos. With like De La Cruz, you know, he signed when he's early, you know, 20s. Those are uh, potential for a nice long career. Those are the rookie cards I'm looking for. All right, Jay Allen. Nunez, Pastrana, Verdugo, another Mauricio, Mauricio, excuse me. All right, Jonathan and Class, Clace, Oman Diaz, Wagner, Pedro Leon, and Acosta. All right. Come on now, let's see something really cool. See an auto, or let's see some kind of a chrome insert. Let's see another parallel. You know, I'm looking at these two. I said that one was sky blue. That does not look sky blue when they're next to each other. It almost looks teal. Unless this one's not sky blue. Yeah, all right. Those are definitely different colors. All right, Urbina. There's a Trey Sweeney first for a sweet Yankee. Trey Sweeney. Let's get him sleeved up and check out his stuff here. It's a nice looking product. I definitely dig the foils that they use on these. All right, what do we got here? Yankees, first round, 20th overall. Yankees, first round, 20th overall. Fort Lauderdale, born 2000. So he just turned 22. All right, Zach Veen. He's a Yankee, though, so that's a, probably fairly desirable. 
Sosa, Freelick, Vivas, Swinski, Chirio, Ramos again, and Alvarez again. All right. Well, those piles are still it's starting to creep more towards like uh, 5248 now. Walker, Christian Rua, another parallel, another potential, what is that, it's got to be sky blue, right, or is that teal, no idea, but another first first, so not so bad, am I missing a number on these, I am not, first first, Let's see here. 48th overall, second round. Okay. Peyton Wilson mixed up. First for Cespedes. Cavados. Howard. Rincones. Eduardo Lopez. Acuna. Is that uh, younger brother, you think? Khalil Watson. All right. Luis Sandhel Acuna. That's got to be younger brother, right? Robbie Martin. Triana. Matt Frazier, first first. All right. Is this... Am I missing something? I wonder why this one... That's not numbered, is it? Are these all sky blue and this one's just a little darker? I'll have to take another look at that here in a minute. Matt Frazier. All right. Well, he is a hitter. It's always good. I was just happy to see the other day, more than anything, that uh, my favorite stat finally started popping up under the stats section on ESPN, the war. So it looks like there's enough data on the season that people's wars uh, are starting to pop up. Guzman. Rez, Austin Hendrick, Casas, Bello, Nolan Arenado is up at the top with a one, with a one war after one week. Pretty good. There was somebody else up there, I forget who it was, that had a 1.1 already. I know the youngie for, there's another, De La Cruz, the young kid from the uh, Indians was up there too. Nolasco. All right. Well, we're getting a good amount of parallels. We are definitely getting a good amount of parallels here. Rodolfo Nolasco. All first. So I think mostly first so far, which is definitely nice. All right. I'm going to do this real quick. I'm going to take the rest of these out. I need to see the odds on this box. Oh, wow, we still got quite a few packs to go. Very nice. I like it when there's lots of packs. What is that? All right. Well, the base card pillow, sky blue, one and two. Blue foil, one and 17. Okay, so these are sky blue. These are the sky blues, and then this one's just blue. A little bit, a little different. Couldn't tell with the lighting I got. Just yet, I had to stick it a little bit away from me in the glare of the sunlight to see it. Muziati, but now I see it. Vera, there's Austin Martin. PA again. All right, there's a Ramirez and a Lawler. These stacks are growing. I don't even think we're halfway through this yet. Still haven't seen any real big hit colors yet. Let's see if we can change that. All right, Jason Dominguez. There's a Benny Montgomery. Nice. Benny. Love the way he signs his autographs. Started following him on Twitter just because he posted that one tweet of him sitting in front of the Reds in the Super Fractor saying, hmm, what should I do with these autographs? That was pretty cool. And then I've seen some of his autographs 
and it shows that he gets kind of creative with some of the signatures. So that's fun stuff. Luca Tresh. Rodriguez, San Quentin. You know, and if players are going to start getting that kind of involved, Vargas, with, uh, you know, taking care of the way that they do the autographs and making it fun and backstrom, that's uh, that's just good. There's nothing bad about that at all. If anybody pays attention to football, there's that uh, set called Encased that uh, came out. And some of the uh, quarterbacks were writing, you know, catchphrases on their cards as well. I think Mac Jones said, uh, what did he put on there? It was like a really low number card. Oh, there's a Darren Baker. All right. Darren Baker. I'm going to keep that one for a while. I'm a Giants fan, so I remember him when he was a kid, a baby. Said, uh, do your job. That's what uh, Mac Jones wrote on one of his autograph cards. Do your job. So that was kind of cool. Hmm, I cut it and it didn't want to go in. What's going on here? Let's do another one. I don't want to damage the card. There we go. Do your job, though. That's kind of fun. So when Benny Montgomery was, uh, you know, putting some of those weird catchphrases on those cards. I saw those. I saw a few on Facebook. I was liking it. A couple of the uh, guys from one of the Denver card shops ended up with one of them, and he posted it. So that was pretty fun. There's a Montero, Lewis, Trey Sweeney, Serta, and Meyer. Okay, Marcelo Meyer. All right, that feels like it's about halfway through. Halfway through, and, you know, we got a lot of uh, a lot of first moments out of there. So that's pretty cool. feels like we've pulled just about every card in the set. There's a Sugaste first moment. All right. Sugaste. I'll admit, even though I'm a Giants fan, I got never heard of them. I don't really pay attention to the draft. So we're going to have to flip this over and read up. You know, what does he even play? Sugaste. All right, he is a catcher. All right, catcher signed as a free agent. Born 10-23-02 out of Panama. Man, he is young. He is 19 years old. Sugaste. All right, that's a name to watch. Kid that young, man, if he can hit... If he's got a gun on him, who knows? Verdugo. Sweeney again. Casas. It was kind of funny. I saw that uh, Bart had his first stolen base of his career the other night. So I laughed on that one. Kiro, J. Allen. I think he just was a lefty on the mound and went on first movement. So stole it on the pitcher. It'd be hard to replace Buster Posey, though. That's for sure. Leon, Shylan Polanco. Definitely would be tough to replace Buster Posey. I mean, we're talking, you know, I, I've heard people argue he's not a Hall of Famer, but whatever. I mean, who cares what they all think? <laughs> Honestly, the Giants won three World Series during his tenure, and they had never won a World Series when I was a kid. So... Whatever, he's not a Hall of Famer, whatever, people. You know, him and Madison Bumgarner, as far as I'm concerned, first ballot. Boom, boom. Cabrera. Dominguez. Diaz. Gonzalez. Velasquez. Pacheco. And Salas. All right, come on. Let's get a different color in here somewhere. Got any different colors? There's a Martinez, Aguilar, Escado, Gonzalez, Vargas. Holy smokes. Okay, looks like we got to a different part of the uh, collation here because I haven't seen some of these names. That's all right. I don't know how many cards are in this set. Have to figure that out. 
to one of those ones with like 200 cards and we're going to get all of them right here. There's a Gonzalez, Lopez first, Brady Allen, Waddle, Amador Ramos, Noel, Robbie Martin Jr., Taya, come on, let's get an auto in one of these. Give me an auto or give me a chrome something cool. All right, we definitely got another hollow here. Nick Gonzalez. That feels like another blue. That looks, it is another blue. Uh, you know what? I missed it on the other one. I see it now. These are numbered to 150. I didn't see it last time. But they are numbered to 150 or 160 right there. Yeah, it's 150 or 160. It's hard to see. Cool. Yep, that other one is numbered as well. Okay, it's 150. Sweet. All right. Martin Jr., Gonzalez, Jaraba, Meyer. All right, Uribiel Angeles. That's a new one. Montgomery. Sweet. Lots of cards. We're at that 20 minute mark. If you made it this long, thank you very much. We appreciate it over here. Hey, uh, like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you don't mind. It gives us an opportunity to potentially earn some revenue at some point in the future and do bigger and better stuff. I'd love to be able to get to that point where. You know, we get a couple of these boxes, not just for the personal collection, you know what I mean? All right. I've never really been a buyer of bone, I mean, a first edition stuff until this year. I don't know why, it kind of just stands out more. Maybe it's just because I'm a little bit more involved in everything. There's a Rushman. Pie, it's got to be Pie, right? Gonzalez, Lara, Cairo. Oh, there's uh, there's Tatis. Elijah Tatis. All right. White Sox organization. Nice. Fernando's first was in the White Sox uni, right? I think so. Jordan Walker. Lorenzo. Luciano again. Cabadas Campos. Roberto Campos for the Tigers. Well, haven't really hit any huge, you know, I mean, real low number parallels, that's for sure. But we definitely hit quite a few. So. I mean, if they're really one and two packs, I think we're hitting above average. Luis Rodriguez, Anthony Rodriguez, Marte. And Mar Austin Martin. Well, it looks like our first pile is actually pulling away, clearly pulling away now over the non-first Bowman pile. Pacheco. Lara. Baez, Wood, Bello, Bayo, Perez, Lawler, Cerny, Harry Ford, Genovez. Lots of giants in this. Cool. That's going to make me happy. Lots of giants. It's at least the third one, I think. Valenzuela. Pastrano, Matos, Aguilar, Clays, Meyer, Salas, Baker, Ramos, Cespedes. All right, that's just an all dupe pack. All right, coming down to the last three, you guys. Thanks for joining me on this uh, this nice day of opening Bowman First Edition. I finally got it. I'm happy about that. Man, that thing took a while to get to me. I think it was just in limbo. 
you know, I actually uh, was kind of worried there that I might have gotten uh, the short stick and I was never going to actually get it. But it's there. So no worries. All right, two packs to go. Come on, give me a, give me a good parallel here. This one's, of course, been just sitting here the whole time. So maybe you never know. There might be something good in there. Valerio. There is a Michel Gonzalez. All right. Definitely going to have to look and see who the best one out of all these is. Going to have to look. I don't pay attention to the draft, so I just flat out don't know. But hopefully a couple of these guys turn out well. And I guess time will just tell, right? Escato, Mauricio, Guzman, Ramos, Harris. Last pack, here we go. Maybe a little last pack magic. All right, we definitely have something, but it's probably nothing big. Alcantara, Julio Rodriguez, and that's a gold to 50. Julio Rodriguez, gold to 50. So, a little last pack magic. All right. Very nice. Said so probably not something big, and it was actually bigger than I was expecting. Thirty-one out of fifty, very nice. All right, here we go. Curtis Mead, Frazier, Baker, Hernandez, Aguilar, or Aguiar, excuse me. Sanchez, Allen, Aldue. All right, you guys, that is Bowman first. Bowman first edition for twenty twenty-two. Here's all the hollows, a little recap. Got the Gonzalez, got a Campos, all for this first, first. Quiero, first, very nice. Polanco, Sugaste, first. Darren Baker, Benny Montgomery, Nolasco, nice. Frazier, Rua, Sweeney, Pineda. We got a Khalil Watson blue to 150. Nick Gonzalez blue to 150. And a Julio Rodriguez to 50 gold. All right. Thanks, everybody, for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. Check out the website, tedahouse.com. We got lots of cool cards up on the website. If you see anything from any of the videos that you need to have for your set. I don't know if you're trying to complete something, always feel free to shoot me an email at info at tedahouse.com. That link is at the bottom of the webpage. And as always, uh, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we will see you next time.